Working in the fields of central Montana would look a lot different without heavy equipment. MTN's Asher Line introduces us to the Big Bud tractor that is picking up the slack in the fields. This tractor right here is a Big Bud, one of the biggest tractors in the world. The company that produces them is starting to produce a new one for the first time in over 30 years. 1991 was our last production run. A lot can happen in 32 years. For big equipment company, they've seen a void created in the ag industry, a void they're looking to fill with their new 2023 640 Big Bud tractor. The void that's that's been created is that the tractors have become so computerized and so specific that farmers really don't have a choice but to hire outside mechanics to come in and do even minor work to the tractors. They are partnering with Rome Agricultural and Construction Equipment out of Cedartown, Georgia to help put big buds back in production. We just felt strongly that there was a need for someone to make a good heavy duty tractor uh, and do it differently than what's presently being done with the major manufacturers. One of the primary objectives of this new tractor that's rolling out is to provide a tractor that has components that can be repaired by farmers, mechanics, or dealerships without restriction. So we wanted to go back and build another tractor that represents what we think is putting the end user or the owner in control versus leaving it as it is at the present time where they can do very little to keep their own equipment running. It is one of many designed by Keith Richardson, who has designed dozens of different tractor variations. I can just sit and draw pictures all day long. I enjoy it. And I always like doing something new, you know, anytime. And so uh, this is a challenge. And one of the things I like about it is involving more people. It seems like uh, we've had a lot of calls and a lot of interest, a lot more than I have really anticipated. The 640 is set to be released in March so they can show it at the Con Expo trade show in Las Vegas. In Haver, Asher Lined, MTN News.